What is going on my Super Saiyan which is Ramsa here and today I bring you some Dragon Ball Xenos 2 news in regards to Black Goku and the pre-order bonus. Now in case you've been living on a rock and don't know how this works, if you pre-order Xenos 2 or buy the day one edition uh, the first week that when the game comes out, you will receive a code that unlocks Black Goku in the game. Just like how it happened with Xenos 1 with Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. However, the problem that happened with, with Xenos 1 was a lot of people ended up not pre-ordering the game. On top of that, there's some even who pre-ordered it and didn't get Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta because there was so much more demand than there was supply of Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta codes. With that said, a lot of people sadly ended up not getting Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta and Xenos 1 and that was kind of a big problem. So obviously when Xenos 2 revealed Black Goku to be the pre-order bonus, the question rose once again, well what about those who can't pre-order the game? What if the demand is too high again? What if we get another Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta incident in Xenos 2? Well that's the good news. Kimundi, who is actually the Banda Namco Europe community manager, posted this on Steam saying, the pre-order playable character will also be available for sale later on, smiley face. We want to reward our fans to pre-order the game with a free playable and early access, but we don't want other players not to be able to enjoy him, so we, he will be offered for sale at a later date. So there you have it, that's really really good news to those who can't pre-order the game, now you don't have to panic, and to those who do pre-order, you still get the incentive because number one, you get the character for free basically, and two, you get early access. Now something I wanted to point out since this question has popped up a lot in uh, regards to Super Saiyan Rose. People have been asking, will Black Goku, the pre-order bonus DLC version, have the Super Saiyan Rose transformation? And Hirano-san has already said, no, he will not. And the reason why is because when they had created the character, they had no clue that he had a form yet. In fact, right when they finished the form is when the episode of Dragon Ball Super aired that revealed the transformation. So with that said, they weren't able to program it just quite yet. However, he did state that he wants to release the Super Saiyan Rose character version of Black at some point in the future as part of one of the DLCs that they plan in the game. So I assume it will probably get like a standalone transformation similar to what we saw with Super Saiyan Blue, Goku, and Vegeta in DLC Pack 3 of Xenoverse 1. As of right now, we have no clue what's going to be planned for the DLC pack. All we know is that there's going to be four packs released at some point post-release. And if it's anything like Xenoverse 1, was we'll get a lot of content so we'll get new quests new main story missions new characters uh clothes attacks all that good stuff so once i get information what the dlc is going to be i'll let you guys know then but for now i guess uh the question i want to ask you is, is what dlc do you want to see in xenoverse 2 actually here's one i'm gonna toss out there before in this video i would not be opposed if for one of the dlc packs they gave us dragon ball fusion characters now obviously you can't give us every single character, but I'm just talking about like the main ones, like Janimbu, maybe, maybe Karoli, Boroto. If you've been playing Dokkan Battle inside of Dragon Ball Fusion's banner that came out a couple weeks ago, that's what I'm talking about. Like I would not mind if they gave us those characters in Xenoverse 2 as part of DLC packs where they basically fuse wacky characters like Kid Buu and Janimba and just give us a brand new character. Like I would not be opposed if they did that. With that said, I want to hear from you guys. What DLC do you want to see in Xenoverse 2? Let me know your thoughts on that in the comment section below. Anyways, if you're hyped for Xenoverse 2 and excited for what's to come with the game, make sure you leave a like right below. Any other questions? comments feedback feel free to drop a comment down below and i guess i will see all your awesome super sandwiches in the comment section below peace